<clears throat> Isn't there... Isn't there supposed to be a light? Man, she freaking died like that? Dang. Taking this death though. <laughs> you ain't gonna use it. Nice. Wait. Right here. <laughs> Don't be Kool-Aid man and me. That's insane. Okay. Oh! I feel fucking gr- oh, What's going on, this is Johnny, and welcome back to episode number 23 of the Fallout 4 campaign. Today, we're leveling up for sure. We have four points we're gonna put in. Um, I think what we'll do is... That's 41. Don't want that. Um, we don't really do much hacking. Let's do Gun Nut. That'll give us level 3. Let's do strong back. Uh, do 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 do. Let me see here. Chemist, animal friend, aqua boy, blacksmith, do blacksmith, melee weapons, armorer. Yes. Hmm. Medic. Okay. Boom. We got it. Alright, we gotta reach the house. That's the first thing we're gonna do today. We're gonna make it one little push. Um, or not like a, a funnel push, but like a push just to do some of the main missions and get these done. I would say we have probably like five or six episodes left, but I'm not really for sure. I'm gonna try to keep it under 30 episodes, but I cannot really uh, guarantee that. Phenomenal. How can something that sickly move that I got him. Don't you worry about it, goat. Okay. Put one over here. I gotta do pinned. <clears throat> dog is snoring and it's very loud if I apologize if you guys hear that <laughs> who's there Lock and load. <laughs> I got him. He's out of here. Okay, good. You start rolling. I need your stuff. Oh, someone should make use of it. Okay. Um. Go ahead and see if we can't get some stuff off these bodies. Reduces damage from animals by fifteen percent. I'm not gonna lie to you. Really don't want that. But it is what it is. Okay. We gotta go in here. Is that what we gotta do? Sure. We'll go in it. Hi. Oh, thank God you're here. I was starting to worry we might not make it out of this mess. Everything's taken care of. You're safe. It was bad enough when Wallace reacted so poorly to our arrival, but then Gunners? I was not prepared for that. I know he's potentially important to Phase 3 and all, but I'm not sure it's worth putting ourselves in harm's way. If you're really important to the answer, then it's worth it. As far as I can tell you, rolling in harm's way because you screwed this up. Um, how, I, I'm telling really you, A is like the just the perfect freaking response for almost everything. You're right, I suppose. I know they've been keeping an eye on him for years. Not sure how they originally found him, but probably don't want to know. But once they realized how smart he was and what an asset he could be for Phase 3, they watched pretty closely. I think they even fed him scientific material from time to time to see how good he was, you know, testing him to see if he was institute material. Let's just get Wallace and get out of here. No argument from me. Let's go. Right. There's just, well, there's a slight problem with that. 
He doesn't want to go with us. I was thinking, maybe you could try and talk to him. No problem. I'm sure I can get him to see reason. I hope so. We really need him. Speak to Wallet. Broken. Huh? How am I supposed to get the fuck in there and then talk to him if he's in here and I can't access pretty it? pretty excited being named the next director. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? Um... Don't be ridiculous. Of course I'm not a robot. That's exactly what a robot would say. I've heard all the stories. I know exactly what happens to people when the Institute shows up. Well, it's not happening to me. Okay, let's go ahead and save. Uh... Let's do the red one. Just shut up and listen to me. We're not here. Okay, all right. Boom, we did it. What do you want from me? First try. Why are you here? The Institute needs your help, Mr. Wallace. It's as simple as that. My help? With... with what? The Institute has an engineering problem that your scientific expertise could help solve. In exchange for helping us out, you'd be granted access to the most advanced research facility imaginable. Whatever research you wanted to perform, anything, it's possible there. I promise. You'd be safe and secure in a way that's completely impossible anywhere else. You'd be helping us create a better world. That... That sounds good. Okay, fine. Why are they doing that? I'll go. Ah, <sighs> okay. I think we've got this... Must be the control. camera or something. Thanks. I mean, thanks for the assist. Hey, I'm here to help. You're welcome. I really mean it. I owe you one. I'll see you back in the Institute. Do I think A is like, like you being nice, B is you being a dickhead, you know, one's a sarcastic one and then the other one's whatever. So I think A is usually the one that you want to go for just because you're trying to be a nice person and that's like the only one you got. Okay, let's go back. Let's go ahead and get out of here, Commonwealth. Then we'll go back. I'm just really just waiting until, um, we can start doing railroad missions because then then we know we're like on our final little stretch. So we're just gonna keep helping Father until we can we can do that. Let's go ahead and talk to Father and see what we gotta do next. Eventually things are gonna start popping off for railroad. So I'm excited. Ah, there you are. I cannot express how pleased I am. Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his surroundings. Yet he's already pointed out several inefficiencies in our methods. With his help, Phase 3 will be ready in no time. And it's all thanks to you. I'm proud to help the Institute. Here's hoping it all pays off. At this point, there is no doubt. It will succeed, and very shortly. There is one more part for you to play. And I think you might enjoy it. It is time to announce our presence to the Commonwealth. To request that they do not interfere with our plans. You should be the one to do it. That's a good idea. Hopefully we can prevent violence and save some lives. Yes, that is one goal. And if you are to be the new director of the Institute, you should be the one to do it. We've prepared some remarks for you to record. Once you're finished, We'll broadcast them to the entire Commonwealth. Use the microphone here and follow the script. It's quite simple. I'm sure you'll do fine, Father. I'll record the speech. For years now, you have suspected that the Institute still exists. That we are among you. It is true. But it is not the whole truth. We're here. And we are. 
<laughs> Your new masters. <laughs> the future. Our superior technology represents the future of the Commonwealth. Today, we activate our nuclear reactor, ensuring that we will persevere long after the world above ground ceases to exist. Ensuring that mankind has a future. We have no desire to interfere in the unimportant details of your daily lives. We simply insist that you do not interfere with Institute operations. To do so would result in... Unnecessary difficulties for all parties. Rest easy. Know that the future is... in safe hands. And that mankind will thrive under our guidance. Well, that was... Interesting. Perhaps not what we originally intended, but it will certainly get your point across. Now it's time to make sure that everyone hears it. How would you feel about making a little trip to Diamond City? I could use some fresh air. A quaint phrase. Though I'm afraid the air there is anything but fresh. The radio station in Diamond City is listened to by many in the Commonwealth. If we'd like the people to hear what we have to say. It's the best way to reach them, before we preempt their broadcast. We need to ensure it reaches the maximum range possible. I've been assured that the necessary parts are on site. You'll just need to install them to boost the broadcasting power. Report back when you're done. We should be ready by then. Cool. Reconfigure the transmitter. And that would be Diamond City. Let's go ahead and go there, figure this out, and then hopefully, I'm, I'm assuming here soon is when Railroad will start kicking in because we, we just we gotta be getting very close. Then we can start just doing their mission. I thought she's gonna run up to me and talk to me. Okay, we need to go in the back. The back is where, um, the radio station is. I want to be left alone. We were, we were actually here before, but Diamond Street Radio. A radio. Radio station. Um. Well, <laughs> well uh, you'll notice there aren't any other ones. So. Huh. Travis. Don't uh don't don't break my stuff if you uh if you don't if you don't mind. Hey, I mean I mean I mean hi again. Uh hi hi Oh okay. I gotta do everything myself. Um Okay, let's where's try this. Everything go exactly. Hey Travis. I, I don't, I don't, uh, okay, I usually don't, oh this is I don't, I don't know if everything has to be in the correct order, let me look, let me look this up real quick. Okay, I got it. Pretty sure. I think it's this one, is button. Maybe this goes here. And then dials, yeah. and then tubes. Alright, in you go. This radio station, um... Bada bang. I love how he just came in there and then just did stuff. Like, he didn't even care. He was like, whatever, just leave me alone, like... Okay, let's go back. Talk to father. Oof. Hey, Faja. Fada fada Faja. Hello, sa, Yuki. You're in here. Advanced system. Please file a report with the facilities division. Looking dark back here. What are you doing way back here, dude? A weirdo. I see him. How do I get over there?
Enjoy your trip to the big city. It's done then? The transmitter has been modified. Everything is in place. It's ready to go when we are. Good. Once the reactor is online, we'll cut into their broadcast. I'll let you do the honors. This, my friends, is the moment we've all worked towards. After all your effort, the time has finally come to start our reactor. No longer will we be forced to compromise to survive. No more will we no, need to worry about outpacing our resources. My father and I couldn't be more proud of what you have helped us accomplish. Where'd it go? And we look forward to achieving even greater things in the future. The Institute is now truly mankind's best. Turn up. Thank you. There we go. Jesus. All of you. Okay. Son. It's almost hard to believe. After all those years of hard work, here we are. We've arrived. Look what you've made possible. We're all responsible for this success. Spoken like a true leader. I'm proud of you. There's more work to be done before the Institute's future is guaranteed. The Directorate has convened a meeting about how to proceed. I'm not going to attend. You should be there as director. Tenant directorate meeting. Okay, so I gotta go down below. There's a door apparently. Uh uh uh. Uh uh. uh. Excuse me. Pardon me, coming through, do my own thing out here. Okay, so let's go and make sure that we ain't actually messing this up. Yeah, let's just continue working with Father. I'm assuming, I would actually say probably after this is when things will start kicking off for us, for Railroad. To practice good sanitation. We could just finish it up with Father too. I mean, we are helping him. Now, I, I do feel like he... Sounds it's either the railroad or, or him. He, he, they're like the, the bigger ones. Have you seen oh, Jay shit, I went the wrong way. <laughs> um, just to be, like, correct and, like, uh, the right thing to do. This is the, uh, the father just wants the sense to go to the top and be okay, I think. Okay, one, one more. Jesus. Couldn't be more be pleased with Father's you, choice for a new we're director. Forward to working with Congratulations. You guys were just like... You guys literally hated me earlier, like an episode ago. I don't want you to be the freaking guy, you kidding me? That's a bad decision. Now they're like, hey, I like it now. Okay. I'm happy to be here, Dr. Fillmore. I hope I do the position justice. I'm sure you will. Right now, we're all here because it's finally time to stand up for ourselves. Let's not be dramatic, Justin. There's nothing dramatic about it. We're in a position to push back, to assert ourselves here. That's what we've talked about all along. To bring you up to speed, obviously there are groups in the Commonwealth that stand in opposition to the Institute's goals. With the reactor now online, we have the ability to not only expand synth production, but to project power to a much greater degree. I'm sure the reactor will improve everyone's life. It's a great accomplishment. Yes, but it's not just that. The Directorate has agreed that steps must be taken to ensure our safety in the long run. Let's not beat around the bush. The Directorate has agreed that the Brotherhood of Steel needs to be eliminated. As the incoming Director, we felt it important to inform you of the decision and get your thoughts on it. So, where do you stand? Hmm. <clears throat> I think the last thing the Institute needs now is to make things worse. We should be trying to avoid conflict, not starting it. I would love to see that big airship fly off over the horizon, but it's not gonna happen. The conflict is already upon us. Unless we end it now, 
It's only going to get worse. We really don't have a choice. If we're to emerge from this the victors, we need to move quickly. As director, it's up to you and how we focus our efforts in achieving this goal. We'd like your input on what direction we should take. Do we increase synth production or focus on weapons development? I've seen enough to know that weapons are the key to winning wars. Let's focus on weapons development. As you wish. The advanced systems folks will get to work immediately. Thank you very much for your time, sir. That's all we have for the moment. I believe Father wished to speak with you once our meeting concluded. To be frank, I don't agree with Father's decision. Okay, compa but completed I'll up. Accept it. Completed up. Completed powering up. X688 sounded very impressed with your work at Libertalia. He doesn't give praise lightly. Well done. Apologies. I have an urgent message from Z114. Your quarters have flooded, sir. There is danger of extensive damage to your personal effects. I'll go right now. Time is of the essence. To avoid any undue tragedy, please see Z114 at once. Okay, meet with. Okay, so yeah, okay, the railroad stuff just got done. God damn, get the out of my way, both of you. All right, we need to gotta go this way. Wait, is our house? Wait, what? Where's your house at again? The house is up here, isn't it? Or am I an idiot? I wish we could. Wait, isn't there like a tunnel that like connects everything together? <laughs> uh, I don't remember. Remember the tippy top? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then go over here like this. Just like so. And we can jump down like that. And then we is here. What took our five so long to reach you? You must act now. The Brotherhood of Steel has discovered the location of the railroad. I'll warn them right away. Thank you. I was hoping for more time to organize a rebellion, but it's clear we cannot delay. Once you secure the railroad against the Brotherhood, tell your people we are ready to fight. Go. Now. Okay, let's go meet with Desdemona. Now things are starting to... Now we're in like a little... the final stretch. God, dude, my fucking nose itches. <clears throat> I gotta get here before that dude gets here. You, you're the real deal. Would you get the f you out of my way? Everybody's always in my way. Z1's rebellion is ready, but we have a crisis. The Brotherhood's on their way here. Des has something urgent for you. What? What are you talking about? Oh, you're still alive. I got here in time. Jesus! Quick, take this. Tom made it for you. Sounds like we're going to need it. Everyone else, mobilize. We got Brotherhood incoming. Assume a railway wife rifle? Move! Move! Damn! The booby trap on the skate tunnel is blown. The Brotherhood? What? Got him. Healthy Jesus. Move it. Desdemona. We're cut off. The catacombs are now our only way out. Glory was guarding the entrance, but she may already be overwhelmed by the Brotherhood. I'll clear the catacombs. Do it. Do it. We can do it. Sir, secure the church. Okay. Fusion core, fusion core. You can't haul my way. 
Go ahead and take all their stuff that they ain't using. Nice. Okay. I think I went the wrong way, didn't I? I did. I definitely, definitely did. My bad, my bad. Get Nick. Jesus. Alright. We actually haven't seen that one sniper rifle. Oh, dude, he got vaporized. But we haven't seen that one sniper rifle um, remember the training from Fallout New Vegas, the 50 cal one. Unless we have, and I don't have it as a 50 cal yet. Maybe that's what it is. Anti-material rifle? Sorry. That's actually the word of it, or the name of it. I wonder... None of them got past me. Damn. That stings. Listen. The railroad's always sitting on its hands. Ugh. You're the best thing that's ever happened. Promise me you'll free them. All of them. I promise. And our words as good as gold. If anyone... Isn't there... Isn't there supposed to be a light? Man, she freaking died like that? Dang. Taking this death though. <laughs> you ain't gonna use it. Nice. Wait, right here. <laughs> Don't be Kool Aid man and me. That's insane. Okay. Oh, I feel fucking gr <sighs> Hey, we gotta get better stuff here. Hold on. Grenades? Yes. Pew pew? No. Oh god. 120 damage. You really want this to be the last hug you Hey, for your prize. Really? Thank you. Live the brother. Not that it's Dead, brother. Oh, you can actually pull you can actually pick that stuff back up. That's sweet. I like that. Oh hell yeah. Dude, hell yeah. I didn't get this the last time I played this game, so this is like new to me. All new. Hold on a second here. That's the last one. Yo, this fucking gun's crazy. What is that? A Gatlin laser? Sure, we'll take that. Go ahead and save. You haven't given it, give it a good save yet. Yeah, I think we're clear now. Officer. Something out. T60 there. helmet. Look, ow, ow. Really? Nice freaking armor, I won't lie. Man's just casually holding a melon. A 
Okay, here we go. Desdemona. You've killed the last of them, and you're still standing. I wish the same could be said for glory. No time for that, though. The Brotherhood underestimated us badly. Their next attack will be far, far worse. So we do the unexpected. We eliminate the Brotherhood as a threat now. And the key to that is destroying their flying fortress, the Pridwin. Fortunately, we've got a contingency plan for that. Tom, we're activating Operation Red Glare. What? But Red Glare requires a Brotherhood vertebrae. Then the Professor will get you one. Count on me. With what happened to... Glory, we need you more than ever. Thanks for stepping up. The Brotherhoods occupied the Cambridge police station. Spotters report they almost always have a vertebird parked on its roof. Take it. And Tom, you're going with him. Me? In the field? No one else can fly the damn thing. This one's for Glory. Move out. Meet Tinker and Tom at the police station. Let's go do the damn thing. Well, that's level 30. I didn't think we'd actually be that high up. To be honest with you. Like, we're taking our time, but we're not taking our time. That makes any sense. Okay, uh, listen to the Nuka-Cola. No. Uh... Speak with father. Pers per per pers precipice? What? What does that word even mean? Okay, college square. <clears throat> Do you need help? Do you need assistance? Little dogs down here need covers. Okay. Now this gun right here is ridiculous. But let's put it away just in case we get to like another um Blood of Steel or something like that. Hope he's here. Uh, <clears throat> Man, how do you live up here? There is a million ways we could be monitored right now. College By the Brotherhood or... Exactly the you intellectual know. hotbed it once was. Relax, Tom. You'll be alright. Now's not the time to overexert yourself. Save that for if the Brotherhood starts heading your way. Right, the whole breathing in and out, okay? The police station is crawling with Brotherhood guys. At least one in power armor. But as promised, they got a vertebrate on the roof. You really up for this? Let's go. Prepping that vertebrate for takeoff is gonna take me a few minutes. So first, we gotta clear the police station of hostiles. I can't believe I'm doing this. All right, let's do this thing. Eliminate Brotherhood forces. Puck buck up. Said puck buck up. I missed. Son of a bitch. This guy's gonna eat stuff, isn't he? Got him that time. Whenever you're done corpse squatting, no, I'm good to go. Okay. Really? So close. Oh my god, I don't know how I missed that. Really? 
we have any, um... Uh, there we go, give one. Perfect. Okay, did I clear it out? Everything cleared? Hope so. Put grenades in this box? I hope so. Oh. A little bit of something, something. Hey. You know, ammo isn't cheap. Oh, Can we just clear. pay you to play dead? All right, we did it. Let's talk with Tinker Tom. Right. <clears throat> we got ourselves some wheels, or oh, oh, wings, or whatever this is. Here's the deal. After flight prep, we take the vertebrate up to the Pridwin and dock. From the inside, the blimp's vulnerable. To keep that baby afloat, it's got massive gas bags full of hydrogen. Tell me about my role in this. Your job is tricky. You gotta find a way to place these explosives on the gas bags. Then get the hell back to our vertebrae. Make it to a comfortable distance, then it's bye-bye Pridwin. Flight prep is going to take time. And the Brotherhood's not just going to give it to us. So if paladins show up, keep them off me and the bird. Okay. Defend the vertebrae. We need to go up. Okay, so is there a... I'm hoping there's like a, um... A way to the rooftop from here. Yep, there is, right here. Perfect. Freaking perfect. So, the manual said... Right. Okay. Where's the master switch? Man, we've got a vertebrate incoming. Oil Shit. pressure, check. I haven't saved in a good minute. Let's probably, we should probably do that. Oh shit, I'm going as fast as I can in here. But I don't know what, what's this panel even do? Hey, could you hurry up? Throttle, full open. Did I do? I mean, I'm I'm doing everything right, right? Within the bird of bird. I'm supposed to get off here. I heard something. Okay, let me uh, let me get back on top of this here. with Beacon? I can't just like freaking talk to you later, dude, like... Hey. First things first. I picked up some Brotherhood goodies for you. Merry Christmas. More importantly, though, Tinker's ready for us on the bird. Let's go. 500 bottle caps for that? My god, dude. Okay. Jump on this, and let's freaking tackle this last little bit here. We'll probably do this mission then call it an episode. Flying to the Where the fuck that thing's called. So uh wheel up Uh so this yoke uh Des said 
and you can fly this thing. Sure, sure. We read the manual cover to cover. The manual? <clears throat> well, he's doing it. <laughs> it's just not very good, I guess. We're spinning! Spinning! Oh, man! Hold it together! <sighs> See? It's just like falling off a log. Dear God, we're dead. De dear God, we're dead. <laughs> Uh. Right. Final briefing time. Glory would have wanted us to go in guns blazing, but I'm thinking finesse. I got you this. If you're wearing the latest in the Brotherhood's fall fashion line, it might help you to place those bombs and get back in one piece. Uh, and the Brotherhood's just gonna fall for that? The Brotherhood is nothing if not arrogant. They'd never dream in a million years that an ex-farmer and a scaver could fly one of their birds. So if we look, walk, and if we're... Okay, so we gotta put that on, I guess. Um, I'm gonna drop that. Hey, you dropped talk something. Like an asshole don't want with a it. Superiority complex, we'll be fine. And even if we don't, hey, if it only buys you a little time, that's better than nothing. When we land, Tinker's gonna keep the vertebrate spooled for an immediate takeoff. And my job is to be Tom's lookout and make sure any looky loos keep walking. Tom, we're getting closer to the blimp. Can you fly just a little straighter? Thinking, man, I'm trying. If you wanna give it a whirl, I won't stop. No, 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 you're doing great, Tom. Just keep her a little more steady. Yeah, 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 I got you. Scabber, this is Claymore requesting clearance. Claymore, you're cleared for launch bay three. Deck officer is requesting an update on the police station. Uh, hostiles eliminated. Scimitar status. Yeah, Confirm. No. Scimitar took some fire. Should be up and running in a few hours. Early lead. We have a visual on you, Claymore. Your docking port's not open. Oh, There's just so much we haven't explored yet. The port thingy. Working on it. Tom? Yeah, yeah, but, but, but which button is it? Uh, there? Claymore, you're clear for approach. You got time to talk now? Okay, we're getting into the ship now. Big floating ship. Okay. Plenty explosives. Remember, keep that brotherhood uniform on. Otherwise, it's going to be the shortest infiltration. Unless you like getting shot. Shut up. I'm here to blow your ship up. <clears throat> Alright, let's go ahead and save it just because we do some dumb something. Okay, just because we do some dumb, we can, um. You know. Reload. Main deck. Okay, we gotta go up. So how did it look out there? We've got a lot You came of in on Claymore, right? The Stop right there. Stop! Intruder! Area sweep. Now <laughs> Oh what? Is there not a way to go up to the top from here? What the actual Oh, okay, I see it. You can load it. And this is why I did that, even though it didn't save right here. We just gotta go to the tippy top. I can't here. help but notice your empty. Wait, where are you? Hey, intruder! One we down. An intruder. Target three acquired. Okay. I get escape. Oh my god, of course. I wasn't paying attention at all to my freaking health. 
I can't help but notice you're empty-handed. Please, tell me that Halen remembered to load my package on Claymore. Those technical documents may be exactly what we need to repair Liberty Prime. So you understand the urgency. Halen didn't give us anything. Not our fault. That's so unlike her. I'll just have to ask Kells to send another Verda bird then. One down. Okay, one to go. Now to get out of here. I think I did it. We did it the right way now. Without freaking getting caught. <clears throat> All I do, all I had to do was just talk to that guy. He was the one that was like, "Yo, intruder!" Now we can just jump on that freaking vertebrate and get up out of here. Come on, Nick. Waltz through Brotherhood HQ Don't get too close to your him. side. I can't believe we're actually getting away with this. Yeah, yeah, I got it. All right, all right. Just got to get to a safe distance. More distance, please. You're making this look easy, boss. Well, we're going to blow this dang thing up. We're going to land first, then blow it up. I'm assuming we're probably just gonna land first, right? I don't know. We're out of the blast range now. Here goes nothing. Shit! Whoa. Now that's a hell of a thing. Rest easy, Glory. Dang. I need a drink. Blew them all to pieces. Okay, well, the Brotherhood's pretty much, uh, not here. Not here now, so. <laughs> Gee, look at that. We're landing now. Everyone get off. I gotta find some place to stay. Got See time to talk now? Dude, oh, yeah. look at that. Alright guys, this is what we're going to call episode number 23 of the Fallout 4 campaign walkthrough, let's play, whatever you want to call it. Um, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and show your friends. Always guys, my name is Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode. Perfect. Bye. Perfect.